Hello, YouTubers. This is Cake. And this is Rich. With Boots and Jeans Riders. What we're going to talk about today is something that's unbelievable that we still see riders riding in this particular formation. But first, we want to get oh, to yeah. opening some mail that we received right after this intro. Ran around and now, ran 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 and <laughs> all right welcome back <laughs> welcome back rich gonna open up his mail that he got from bodine bodine 52. 52 i'll let him explain to you yes we're excited we, we got this mail, mail from bodine 52 he actually done a contest <clears throat> on his new bike that he purchased was a road king well, it wasn't new. He just wanted a bike that he fixed up. So make sure you check out Bodine 52 channel. And he had a contest of naming the Royal King. And I won the contest. Mm, <laughs> but, I gave him the name, though. Whatever. But most importantly, check that video out to see why he actually picked that name. The reason he picked it. We just came up with the name. He actually picked it. It is a fantastic reason. I really love the way he, the way he done it. He also rides a... Uh, Harley Davidson Ultra Classic Limited or Ultra Limited that he's named Big Mama. Oh, yeah, him Big and Mrs. Mama. Bodine ride that. But anyway, we'll proceed to open this. I don't want to cut. I got some tape on it, but I don't want to cut. See what we got here. Thanks, Bodine Fifty Two. And he rides with Harley Day Rider, and they have this this Sunday thing they just done. The uh, live stream. Oh my God, that thing was beautiful. What's that? What's that falling? Probably one of the best live streams I've seen so far, cause they're very engaged with with the thing. Okay, here's what we got. We with have two poker chips. <laughs> Holly Davidson poker chips. Thank you, Bodie. I'll take them. And he has his YouTube card in it. So make sure you get you some YouTube card to pass them out. We have probably about a thousand left. We pass them out everywhere we go. Also, oh my goodness, look at that, babe. Oh, a sticker. We don't have a sticker board yet, so this is our, our very first sticker. So when we get a sticker board, yours is going on top, and you're going to lead the sticker board. All Man, right. We're going <laughs> to put the date on it, too. Yeah, so put the hey, above speaking it. Speaking of put it on sticker top. board, how no. about we could stick it on the wall over there? Start that as a sticker board. Oh, green wall? We'll show you that when we finish. Yeah, we're going <laughs> to. We had a green wall oh, up yeah. here. <laughs> going to use a sticker board. So this is going on the sticker board. Okay, and last but not least, see it say Rich and Cake. Did it have the letter? Mm, no letter. Oh, That's the protecting, protecting case. But we won this thing and. I'm not one into ripping it open. It's a thank you, thank you, thank you card with Snoopy on it. Hallmark. Oh, he's rolling in dough. Hey! Oh, oh. <laughs> ah. I'm going to read it right, right quick and say, guys, thank you so much for your support and naming my bike. I'm not going to tell you the name, so you got to go to the channel and watch you get the name. We are on lockdown, so I cannot get out a gift card. He's supposed to send a gift card, so he sent twenty-five dollars. Hey, I like winning uh, <laughs> cash. We have to do. Love your channel. Appreciate you both. Be safe and healthy, Bodine Fifty Two. Thank you, Bodine Fifty Two. I don't know where we go spend it at because all the restaurants are closed. <laughs> Excuse me, that's a Bob. Bodine 52. Yeah. Thank you, Bob. Maybe he didn't want everybody to know his first name. It wouldn't have been on the card. Anyway. Okay, I'll take that. <laughs> Thank you. I can use this for my um my gas tank for social distancing. There you go. Now, we're going to get to why we actually doing this video. It, because it's amazing how we still see people ride in this formation and they just don't get it. And the formation we are talking about is we see so many riders just for some reason still riding side by side, handlebar to handlebar. And I just think, I'm just be out there, be honest with you. I think it's the dumbest thing you can ever do. 
the very dumbest. Except, you know, there's certain groups that does it, right? And then you have police officers. Right. They do it, but it's only for show. And if you're riding in... Uh, one of them performancing groups like the, the Gold Angels. Yeah, and... we had the Gold Angels out here. Yeah. And of course you're riding like that because you're performing and you're showing off. And if you talk to any police officer, or I would say any motor officer, that's going to be honest with you. And they will tell you that, hey, we ride side by side for parades, shows, and some of them ride side by side on the freeway. And even though they have professional training, that is still extremely dangerous. So I don't know why anyone would want to do that. Right. And if you're coming out to visit California and ride with boots and jeans riders and you think you're going to ride side by side with us, don't even waste not your time coming happen. out. We're not. It's not going to happen. And if you have a friend you're riding side by side and you're riding in one of the group rides that we put in, then you're definitely riding in the back. You're not taking all of us out. We have a friend that rides in our group. And another him and another guy, they both ride in our group, but one don't ride anymore. But I they want to ride side by side. They want to do it up front. No. No. You get in the back. So in case anything happens, you won't be endangering anyone else's lives while you're trying to ride side by side. And the funny thing See? is, when we addressed him on that, he says, well, we've been riding together for years. We know each other moves. Yeah. Kick and I have been riding together for years, been the, together for years, know each other moves also. Yeah, I know your moves. <laughs> <laughs> so is, anyway, back to the that. subject. Ready PG. Back to the subject. <laughs> 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 so, he yeah, I'm blushing. they ride all the time. Him and I ride, but we ride stagger. I'm leading or he's leading and we're on each other. Right here, side by side, not right behind one another, not directly on on side each other. Why? Because we don't always see the same things. Exactly. What if, what if it's a pothole right in my lane, and then there's a car on my right, mm -hmm. so I can't go right. So the only way I need to go is oops. And what I'm doing. Exactly. We, we still don't get it. Uh, if you're riding like that, just, just stop it. It's all about safety. And we're not even going to talk about gear, all the gear all the time. Just dumb riding. I mean, if somebody say, well, if you practice it with the same person over and over and over, you can get good at it. No, it's not going to happen. No. Let's take a even, different scenario. Listen, listen. Wait, wait. A different scenario is if we ride in, because we ride, do a lot of back roads. We yeah. ride down a road and... A deer jump out there's no human reflexes that's fast as animals and she's looking down the road or I'm looking down the road and I see with my peripheral vision an animal come out my instinct is to break and move, swerve and move and if she doesn't see that animal then again we gone down so stop it I mean stop it stop it stop it this this it's ridiculous I don't understand why even with the head communications right we still by the time I said Richard, the pot. It's too late. And we're gonna we're gonna give you this last true story I know and probably wrap it up. I don't want this video to be that long. Right. So is I know for sure I talk to police officers a lot. I know that there was a motor officer who got out of motors because he was afraid that they were gonna crash. Actually they had two crashes. The same officer crashed twice. They were riding in formation in the squad. I think they had 25 or 20 to squad. They were riding in formation of squad. They on the freeway. One of the officers went down and took everybody behind out except the last two because the last two was just catching up to the squad. And then a second incident occurred. And that's when this guy said, well, I had about enough of this. Highly trained as they are, all the things that they do on motors, he was just afraid if they crash again, it's going to be his time. So I don't know why people does that. It just don't make sense to me. You know, if you guys do it, hey, just stop it. You can write some comments in below whether you agree or disagree. It doesn't matter. We're not gonna change how we feel about riding side by side. Nope. Yeah. Ever, 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 ever change it. Not one. Ever. Yeah. Although we side by side right now. And look, we probably could turn the chairs now. Same turn. See? So, See? <laughs> so imagine if if we were on our bikes doing that. Have we ridden side by side? Yes. Normally is in two different lanes, but have we ridden side by side 
in the same lane? Yes, we have. Maybe I'm coming on your right, or maybe I'm passing on your left. That's it. Or if I say, hey, make room, I'm coming up and we just kind of talk to each other. Are we doing it for camera purposes? And that still makes us nervous. So we never, never ride side by side. And no, it's kind of a touchy subject for those who in huge motorcycle groups who like to show off. Nothing like showing off and then being in a hospital bed. Be safe. So I still say that ground is hard. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, that's all we got for right now. Rich from Boots and Jeans Riders. I'm Kate. Remember, ride long, ride hard, ride strong, but most importantly, ride safe. Let's go out for a ride. Let's go. Oh, first, we got to turn the camera off. We're going to turn it off then. That's yours. I don't know how to turn it off. <laughs> got to turn the camera off. Go turn it off. <laughs> hmm. Hmm.